Hey, welcome. I just wanted to show you this new device I got for the Mountain Topper radio. So the Mountain Topper, it suggests that you use only 12 volts. And as you may know, most batteries like this, that say 12 volts, actually use 13.8 volts. I was watching Cliff from QRP School and he was talking about how you don't really want to hook up more than 12 actual volts to the mountain topper because you could, without an, a resonant antenna, you could damage the finals. It might reflect some power down back and it doesn't, it's not super sophisticated and, and that it's a very small radio so you have to be very careful with it. So, what is this device? This is the Droke, I think that's how you pronounce it, uh, step down device. So what it does is allows you to take a battery at a voltage and decrease the power to a certain level. And so let's take a look at that right now. So I have the BioNO power here, 12 volt, 3 amp. All the links to all my devices are all in the description. Okay, before we get started, let's take a sample of the power output. And we have 13.35 volts for my battery, okay? Now, I want to step that down to 12 volts. Let's see if we can do that. So what you have to do is they give you these two, this is the output. They give you two wires in here and you just screw them down. I don't know what you call these, but you put a wire in, you screw it down. So what I, I went in my basement and I found some pretty heavy duty wire here and I stripped it off. I tinned it, I put it in and I screwed them down. Now this device comes, you can buy this on Amazon, the link's in the description, but the plastic part and these parts were separated. You don't have to solder this or anything. You just have to put the top and the bottom on. It's pretty easy to figure out. I also added power poles so I could easily put different sources of power. And my mountain topper is also going to be plugged into here. I'm going to go from here to here to my mountain topper and get 12 volts. Okay, so how does that work? Power poles. I have already calibrated it for 12 volts. But it didn't start out that way. Over here, you can regulate the amps and hear the volts. Now, just so you know, this thing was only like $13. Not bad at all. So if I take this to the left, I can drop the voltage. See, now I'm down to 8 volts. If you wanted to save battery power on a QRP rig, this thing is a great device. For $13, man, it's so simple. But I'm going to bring it back up to max. When I first got it, when I first got it, 13.3 volts. There we are. It said it's calibrated also. So that's at max. And remember, I want to be at max 12 volts. I'm going to get the absolute maximum power out of my mountain topper radio. So I'm going to bring this down safely to 12 volts. Now, I don't have the radio yet, it's still in the mail. I'm gonna take the same type of wire, come out here and go to the mountain topper and use power poles, power pole connectors right here, which are awesome. Now the last thing to do would be to check the voltage. And if you look on here, it should have a positive and negative. Okay, the positive is on the bottom. Okay, this is hard to do, but I got 12.1 volts. I actually might bring that down a little bit and see if I can get 12 volts. So it looks like it's a little bit off. So 11.9 should be 12 on here. Now I'm at 12.02 and here I would be pretty happy at 12.02. But you can see how this takes a voltage and it steps it down. Now, for more on the specs on this, uh, you're going to want to read it. So the input voltage is 6 to 32 volts. Output voltage is 1.25 to 32 volts. Output current is 5 amps max and it's adjustable also. As I said here, the amperage is adjustable also. But I'm not going to need that because I'm not worried about that. I'm worried about voltage. Okay, and it has some modes in here. It also has a USB drive right here. I'm not sure what that's for, actually. The USB output voltage is consistent with the module. Okay, so it's an output voltage. 
the USB output voltage is consistent with the module output voltage when the USB indicator is in. I'm not going to use that. I'm just not going to worry about it. All right, it has some function descriptions here. F0. If you press some of these buttons into, there's a couple buttons in here. There's an enter and a set. It says F0 mode, display output voltage. F1, display input voltage. F2, alternatively, display input and output voltage. So let's hit those buttons and see what happens. So I'm going to hit, I guess that turns it off. F0. Okay, there's the input voltage. See, it says in right there. Output voltage. It's kind of weird out how it jumps. Oh, it's going back and forth. Input, output. That's pretty cool. Output, 11.9 volts. And output. Okay, so that's what it does. That's all it is. It's a step down for 13 bucks. Not bad. You will be seeing this in my mountain topper videos. I might, you might even be able to use this to down put the powers to last longer in your battery. All right. Hope you enjoyed it.